bro. What's the word, though? All right, All right man. Welcome, ready? welcome, welcome. So, welcome. It is your guy, Javi Wear the Pop. Javi, can what? I do my countdown, sir? Oh, good Lord. <laughs> <laughs> welcome, Nizzle, <laughs> man. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> welcome to the show for sure. Let me start my <laughs> countdown and we're going to get on into it. All right? Man, All right. Let's get it. Let's do it. I'm too turned, got the black jump. If I pop this perk, then I'm pop something. Hey. Nah, I ain't even gonna do that. Left his eyes wide like who that? who that? I was always told to hit first. And if he ain't that, then I shoot back. Gotta get mine, you fuck about yours. How about the whip go? Alright, 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 you know what's going on, Shay Speak. Gang, in the top. I mean, we here. Hey. Hey. Yes, sir. Right. Let's get right into it. So who is Nizzle Man? Where you from, bro? Um, Nizzle Man, I'm from Staten Island. Now I mean, now I'm known as Staten America. You know what I'm saying? Um, New York. I moved out to Cali for, for the last four years. I just came back, 2019. I just came back. Um. Hmm. Nizzle Man's New York, man. Like I'm, I'm right now today. What's going on? I'm representing Staten, Staten America. Out the Facts. And I start. That's heavy on it. <laughs> what is okay? Wait a minute. For someone who is <clears throat> from Atlanta, shout the East Side Zone, see the Caden on top of <laughs> you. Feel me? I've been, I've been in the A too. I got family out there. I've been oh, in Atlanta. Sure. I did a couple shows out there in Atlanta too. I was just on tour, um, Justina Valentine, and we did. Okay. I don't, know, I don't know what it was called, but it was like the underground. That's what they was calling in Atlanta, like like yeah. the mm -hmm. underground. And Hitman mm -hmm. Holler came, and mm -hmm. a couple, couple of Atlanta people came out to it. It was in 2019, right before Corona, we did that. But oh, um, wow. yeah, oh, okay. I it, it, yeah, I love yeah, it. Yeah, that was that. That was actually one of the questions we we're gonna ask you tonight for sure. We we're gonna ask you about that the, uh, the Justina Valentine um, Valentine tour. Like, how was yeah. actually being on that tour? I mean, that tour, pardon me, that tour was a blessing. Like, it was like nothing but a blessing. It was fun. It was it was fun, and it definitely was like I would say like a ideal first tour. Like, it was a great first tour to be on. Like, we had a great mentor like on it, but it was really like. Like twenty eight, I think. What we, did, I don't know. I, it was plus twenty eight plus cities, and we did it all on a like on a bus, like going mm. bus. And, and mm. Like so, like for me, I felt like I had like a taste of something that I wasn't around for. Like when they used to do that shit back in the day, all the time. So it's like, you know what I mean, it was definitely an experience. And like when we got into Detroit, like the kids was running behind the bus, like so it was like some real movie movie mode. That's what's up, man. So you was on them. So you, so did y'all go like perform at yes, one city? Sir. Perform at like, yeah. like let's say like you perform Atlanta, then you had to go like straight to New Orleans to perform like, like you know what I'm saying? Like, so as soon as y'all get off the bus, as soon as y'all get off the, as soon as y'all get off stage, y'all get on the bus and go to the next city. It was like yeah, that. That's yeah, wow. cause I remember, I remember we came from, I don't know where the hell, like we was like going up and then they had just added a new, a new like show onto it. So like we had to drive like, to it but i know when we got to denver like when we got to denver like i literally got there pulled in we sound checked and then went on like and then mm -hmm. from there we was like we got back on the bus and we hit the road because it was like really like we on the bus so we did like, any any delays with that delay us and it's like it wasn't i think i think like the people that i had got signed onto the tour with 
I don't even think it was about money. Like it just made mm. sense how many right. stops it was. Cause like Justina, mm. Justina had the bus behind as well. Like, so it's not like she was flying to like, like everybody was kind of like on like a brigade. So it was just like, mm. that shit was so lit. That, that just sound lit, bro. I ain't gonna hold it. That just gonna sound lit. I go from city to city. Atlanta, Atlanta was lit when I got to Atlanta. Like my um aunts, like my mom's sisters and my mom's brother, they was backstage. They was there. Okay. So, I didn't get to see them in the wild. It's like my Spanish side. Mm. Okay. Spanish side. Oh, so that's that go that goes back to who you are. Okay, so you're you okay. Tell me a little bit more about you, man, because we jumped straight into the gusto for the for the tour, you know. What I mean? <laughs> right. Yeah. Like, so who, who I don't even know how we got oh Atlanta? That's how we got the Waffle yeah. House. Yeah. yeah. My favorite restaurant. Waffle House is my favorite restaurant. I swear to God. <laughs> you said wait, you said hold on. What what restaurant? What's which one in Atlanta? Waffle House. Waffle House. <laughs> the Waffle House. The, wa the Waffle House. <laughs> and not even on some like 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 tourist shit. Waffle I really, house. I really do it, but like I will eat the waffle. I, like I love breakfast food. Like and like I mm. would eat the waffle house three times and then still go to like when I first went to Atlanta, they had twists. Like I don't know if y'all ever went there. Like 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 twist was, is what made me ever start eating. And we all I used to just eat pizza. I went to Twist and I asked them one time. I'm like, yo, y'all could put fried chicken in the pasta. <laughs> they was like, they was like yeah. <laughs> Swear to God, it was not up in New York. They wasn't doing that at Applebee's and no other place. Swiss was like, yeah, I ate that shit. Alfredo with um fried chicken, and it was different. But yeah, That's I'm Puerto Rican. I'm Puerto Rican and black. You know what I mean? Rest in peace to my moms and my pops. They both passed away 2019, 2020. You know what I'm saying? Condolences, man. Condolences, man. Heavy. Yeah, heavy. Wow, wow, okay. That's deep. Well, hold on, hold on. Let me hold on. One one more question. So, what's your favorite meal at Waffle House? You're gonna say the goddamn all star special out of all the questions. Right. Nah, he, wanna make, he wanna make sure I'm not a tourist. Like I ain't just, <laughs> just because I know it's in Atlanta and like the like all star. But the waffle yeah. I got the same everywhere. It's not the same everywhere. That's true. Like, That's true. It's not, that is, it's not, like right, when I when true. I was on tour, I was like, yo, Waffle House. Like when I'm on tour. You know what I eat? Cracker barrels. Like I'll I'll stop at cracker barrels like on top. Yeah, cracker barrel. Cracker barrel. Cool. You know why? When I go on a cracker barrel, it reminds me of a cracker. And right. Exactly. <laughs> it's just that I can't eat when I'm feeling. Nah, you know what? Racial profile. You know what I'm saying? You know what? <laughs> she said, she said when, like, I never had it. I never crazy. had it. And I'm gonna be honest. Like when I first had it, I did feel like wait. I was like. Yo, like cracker barrel, like the hell, <laughs> but like the macaroni and cheese was like somewhat doable. It was doable, so it's like yo, like I don't like really eating processed food no more. So it's just like that mm. shit, like it kind of it tastes good, like so, like like I don't know, like but waffle house, all star, and then I get extra, extra no homo, extra sausage. You know what I mean? <laughs> All right, so honestly, you know, we take a lot of we take a lot of hikes in New York, right? Right, Nizzle. So, like, what's the longest walk you took from on, like on Staten Island? Because I ain't gonna lie, I walked from the ferry like all the way to Staten Island Mall one time. I I did that. Nah, but you're out of control, bro. <laughs> <laughs> he said he ain't walking no damn way. Like, yo, nah. Like, I don't know if y'all ever been to Staten Island, but like, not like, yet, not yet, not yet. But we going. Yeah, both from Atlanta. Well, I'm I'm free. Me and Shay, we in Atlanta right now. Uh, but right, I'm originally from man. Miami. I'm originally from Miami. That walk he talking about, you know how the highway in Atlanta just is a circle, right? Yeah, yeah, that's where he. Imagine walking that circle one time. Like <laughs> that's what he just did. Like what he talking about. Like he out of control. I can't. Nah, talk. Nah, how nah, many hours that took you? That, that shit. Yo, how many hours it took you, Javi? So don't lie, neither. <laughs> so wait a minute, Javi. You so wait a minute, all Javi. day. So hold on, he he. Yo, it took a hours, hot minute, bro. <laughs> it took a hot minute, bro. So hold on, where, where did you walk? Where walk did you walk with or some shit? <laughs> <laughs> like like three three hours. Damn, like, you know, three hours from for like the from like the ferry all the way up to like I think like a little bit past Port Richmond it took like three hours. But you was doing like forty pounds. What happened? You lost like forty pounds. He was marching. <laughs> he was marching for a cause. <laughs> nah, I, mean, I, was, I don't know. That's when he was born, man. Oh, he was playing shit. school, shit like. 
Oh, nah, nah, yeah. bro. That's not something you do. You don't get bored and be like, yo, I'm going to walk a million man march today, nigga. Like, <laughs> you bugging, bro. Like, that like, is we, hilarious. Like, I don't know, we do, like, we did, like, we do a lot of walking, though, in Staten Island. Like, um, the furthest I walked, bro, was from the mall to Port Richmond, though. Like that's a see that's a bomb though. He acting like that's not that's still nah. Bomb, it though. is, but but that was under that was under desperate measures. Like there was you know Staten Island, there ain't no buses running at a certain time. They cut the buses off. He said so like, that's different. <laughs> now I mean we were sick. We were sixteen. Buses was cut off. We was in a white neighborhood. It was getting crazy. We was getting followed. <laughs> no cabs was coming. So it's like, bro, we. Was angry we had to walk. You talk about you got bored because you want right. You want it, bro. <laughs> yeah, bro. Like, yeah, I, I used to take a lot of hikes where I ain't uh, right. <laughs> Yo, is bro still on or is it my screen that's doing that? No. Oh no 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 no. They no, um he right. probably he probably stepped out. Yeah. He stepped away. Right. No, I just want to yeah. make sure because like I don't know. So what community sure. point stand line did you uh visit during the summers? You said what? What pool on the island was you at during during the summertime? What community pool? Community pool? I ain't going to no community. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, boy, this nigga trying to be, he trying to be funny. Nizzle man, like, he, Yo, boy. Hobby, and you know these are hobby questions because we don't know shit about no goddamn yeah. fat, fat island. So I'm, I'm like. like you trying, trying to be a comedian. <laughs> like, like, <laughs> no, boy, what the hell? Like, what I look like. <laughs> <laughs> I like that though. Oh my gosh, she like, don't you be trying, hell man? Don't you ever no. your wife? Shout don't out, you? Shout out, shout out, shout out, shout out, Javier, his walking and and, and public school days. <laughs> that nigga's reminiscing, bro. Like he want to know what he want to know what what public pool I was in, where I walked in, bro. You trying to go back to your your your, your book you days, really? bro? Like, oh you know my god. Man? Shout out Faber Park, though, it's, it's, man. Shout out, shout out Faber Pool. That's the Port Richmond, man. That's that's the last community pool I was in. And, and oh, see, like, see, I, I and told got, you. And got crazy. But that shit wasn't, that was years ago, bro. Like, 2018. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, I ain't talking about now. I'm saying, like, back in the day when you were. Nah, you said like, this summer, bro. You said, yo, this summer. You said this nah, summer. Nah, during the summers. I meant, like, back in the day. My bad, gang. My bad, yeah. my bad. Like, back. I, haven't been, I haven't been in New York in, like, like. Like a year now, some change. I'm about to come back though. Yo, J Pit, what up, bro? J Pit in the building. That's J Pit right there. Yo, what up, boy? What's good? What's good? What's good? Hey, All right, so pretty much. Uh, so he he tried. He said you felt like who he is straight tried you with the community pool with yeah, the like, walks. Yo, bro, community <laughs> pool. And like, yo, I'm in the community heavy. Like, I'm still in town, but like the community pools, bro. Like, that's, like, <laughs> Like, who the hell? You gotta be a different breed, bro. You gotta be a different breed to be a grown man in the community pool. Once you get past, once you get past six, you're a grown man in the hood. Like, you don't have to be in the community pool, bro. Mr. Man said, don't be no grown man in no damn community pool, bro. The fuck? Like, what you want, bro? I'm gonna give you that pass because you you from the island. I'm gonna give you a pass. <laughs> Don't be asking nobody else about long walks and community pools, man. Nigga. Like, anybody else, bro? Don't be doing that. Shit. Yo, I was trolling him, bro. I was trolling him. I swear. Nah, Yo, nigga. I knew that shit was gonna work, bro. I knew it was gonna work. But nah, the serious questions though. Like, what does diversity mean to you in the in the ent uh, entertainment industry? I couldn't get that out, studying. Diversity? Yeah. Um, I mean, diversity is what it is. You know what I'm saying? With the with the definition of it, multiple people being involved. Like, what it means to me is that, you know what I'm saying? Like, people, some people take that shit and run a mile with it. Like, you know what I mean? In both directions, like, for the good and for the bad. Like, you got diversity, a.k.a. culture vulture. You know what I mean? Which is still a form of diversity, but mm. it's taken to the mile on the wrong way. Then you mm. got dudes like Post Malone, like that came into the hip hop industry, the Eminem's, like, you know what I mean? And added on to it and, and show diversity. You know what I'm saying? So, like, to me, it's just something that it is. Like, you know what I mean, you got, we got rapping with, with, with Spanish music now. So, I'm here for it. Mm. 
Mm, so, all right, bet. So, are you, are you, can you ask, you actually speak Spanish in Israel? Um, I speak a little bit. Okay. I like, Hola. I feel, like, I feel like if you speaking to me, I'm going to speak. Like, if it's in context, like, mm -hmm. if we in context, mm -hmm. especially if I'm in front of you, like, and we and we speak, right. it don't matter. Like, I'm going to conversate with you. So, like, I say I speak it, like, I will, I'll conversate. It might not be what it's supposed to be. Like, it's broken Spanish because, like, I take English and then I figure out the words I know in Spanish and then I mash them shits together. Like, mm -hmm. right. So you ever done a song with where you rap in Spanish? Um, I never rap completely in Spanish. I mean, like I did, I've done the like regular say my things, but I, I definitely wrote a verse in Spanish, like for for a Spanish American artist that rapped in English but knew how to speak Spanish. So like, I mean, like like I said, I could I could write a verse mm -hmm. in Spanish, but will it will it stand up with like? the bad bunnies in them, I don't know because like, I don't know enough words. But like, if if, if I translated it to y'all and y'all was listening, y'all be like, nah, that shit fire because it, it, it'd probably be our slang. Like the words I right. figured out to say our slang. So like, you know what I'm saying? Like, so like, I respect, I respect like my my heritage, my like my culture, like the way it's like, I want to just wild out. You know what I mean? I know enough to do it, but it's like, like I said, like, I want to. I want to just wild out and just try to. Can I smoke on here or not? Yeah. Yeah. Right. Of course. Yeah. It's pit, it's pit for radio. Come on, bro. Are you serious? I just. I just want to make sure. I don't know. Like, what is going? Well, like, it's still not federally. It's still not federally. Like, <laughs> he said it's still <laughs> not federally. Yeah, you good. So look. So, uh, being from New York, give us your top five Staten Island artists. Being from New York, see New York and being from Staten Island, two different things. Bro. I so I try to I try to explain. Right, you right, right, say right, Staten right, America, America at the beginning, yeah, right? Yeah, Staten yeah, America. Staten America. 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 Talk, I could give you, I could give you both. I could give you both though. I could give you the top five okay, New York artists and the top five Staten Island artists. So like, okay, do that. Yeah, me, do that. I, I definitely be the top five New York artists. Obviously, it's Fabio. Myself, you know what I mean? Like, um, I would say G is not as a whole, you know what I mean? Like, because they smashing on everything. Um, fucking Sleepy and, and, and Chef, they still doing what they doing. Um, K Flock going crazy. Told y'all. K, K, K Flock going crazy in the city. You know what I mean? Crazy. The whole, the whole, the whole D, like D thing, like B Love, like they whole group is going crazy. And um, yeah, like female, it's too many, like for to be a top top five New York right now. But like, like, you know what I mean? Because it's like it's mad movements going on right now. It's mad. Oh, so you, this is just New York. So this not yeah. now. Oh, okay. Yeah, that, that was that was New York. Like oh, okay. that was just like New York, like. Like I said, like it would be probably better for me to give a like more controversial for me to say a, a top five of Staten Island than New York because, like, bro, there ain't no top five of New York that I could say with, like because even if I add myself in there and you ask somebody else, they could knock me out and put themselves in my place because like I'm in I'm at the same level as my bros Bino like as far as how I, like like. Or inside all these niggas, mm -hmm. like yeah, we, we, it's a lot of us at the same peak. That, we're we're right. all embracing each other. We popping out to each other's music videos. We we showing love. We performing with each other. So it's like Fabio and them, and th those levels. Like even even on Fetty Luciano, like they they at a different level. So like them niggas is hot. You feel me? Like up and coming, bro. It's a, it's a lot of us. Even Lil TJ. Like like I said, bro. It's too many. It would go crazy. Like. Yeah. It's because I'm in the city right now. I'm like, I'm in the city. But for Staten Island, like, you know what I mean? Staten Island is me, um, Janessa King, um, what my son, my son, um, my son, um, like, of all time or like right now? Of all time. Oh, I right. Ghost, Ghost. I told No, 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 no. Nah, we got we gotta do right now, Nizzle, because I, I cause I knew you're gonna pick two Wu Tang. Like, nah, we're not doing that. 
What you I mean? said all time. Instead of all time. I told right. It. Yo, bro, like, first of all, bro, if this clip ever went rival and she just asked me of all time. Of all time, Staten Island. Five Staten Island. And I don't right. see anybody from Wu Tang, bro. That like that means they personally did something to somebody in my family, bro. <laughs> no, I'm not, that, no, I'm not. That's not what I'm saying. That's not what I'm saying. I'm just saying, like, Wu Tang is always gonna be in the top five all time. Yeah, always but, will. Yo, but bro, like to so y'all, you got a next 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 time you talk to me, ask that question and, and specify. Like, don't get on me because you about to see Shay about to get on me because I, 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 I <laughs> specify. I ain't we no, like, I said we like, yo, I seen her face. She's like, yo, let's see if this nigga get that word out, bro. She was no. like, if you get the word out. No, but look, this look, next time be like, yo, bro, in the last seven months, who's okay. the top five you feel? Because when you say of all time, bro, Wu-Tang started a clan, gang. Like, there's no, yeah. it's a bad stigma. Or like, we're the only people being from Staten Island is the only people that hate that stigma. Think about that, because when we go outside of New York, yo niggas throw up the woo, yo woo tang, and they and they they expect us to love it, but it's like we had a different relationship with Wu Tang, so we right. felt right. differently. But like right. that's been mended. Like me and Ghost spoke several times now, bro. Like Shaheen, right. my big bro. Now I mean, shout out Ray Kwan. Like Nick, it's different now, bro. Like I'm not gonna hold you. Un came home, big bro's home, like. Staten Island's on a different time, and shout out Cash Money, um, Cash Money Baby from Park Hill. He running the right. Niggas is putting on, and it's like, all right, cool. We not all right here, but like, bro, niggas see what's going on. Like, so Wu Tang gotta be there. If not individually, as a whole, they could take up the first spot. You know what I'm saying? Like, facts. But, but if you ain't if you up and coming from the island and you ain't do more than me, I'm not. I would never put you on the list, like, and that's period. He said, if you ain't working harder than me, <laughs> then shit, you ain't. I'm I'm one of the only only Staten Island artists and New York artists left that's truly independent. So that heard Soldier Boys rent, and what I mean by that, like, I'm like shit come out of my pocket. Like I'm truly independent. So. Any any platform you see me on, they fucking with me. They rocking with me. Talk like, your like, shit, bro. Talk like, your it's shit, not me. Yes, sir. Like, I'm saying this is what I'm trying to say. So it's like, I would never put niggas I yes, know sir. that's trying to distribution deals and sign to other shit. Y'all not in my lane, bro. Because I like I do this shit by myself, me and my sister and our, and our company and, and our allies that we built in the streets. Like, so it's like, them niggas don't get the list. But people that 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 did what they did and touched touch grounds, bro, from the island, bro. Like I even put what's the um singing nigga name? Um, damn, what's his name? You know his name? That the singing nigga that was from Staten Island. What's his name? Uh, damn. See, that's what I'm I saying. Think... Like right now, you can't think of it. And that no cap, that's my sister. That's my sister's cousin in law, and I can't even think of his name. But like he put on for the island, I put him on my top five. <laughs> Once I figured out his name, before I put these niggas that just out here. But shout out niggas that's working, bro. You feel me? Like the whole staff is working. And I'm like I said, they're not, they're not in the top five because I'm not in their top five yet. Nigga, <laughs> like, like they how, out there. So working. how long have you been doing music? Um, I've been I've been doing music my whole life. Like, oh. but like seriously, like I could honestly say like 2000, 2000, 2009, like I was 13 when Shaw put me on the on his song. Like and it's like from then like I tried to go crazy like mm. you know what I mean but like a lot of things mm. happened to where I never really like I was I wasn't waiting on shot but I was like I right, like nigga he Wu Tang this is what Staten Island about like it was going on now like, when you say when you say shot say who who exactly are you talking about I'm talking so about so Shaheem, Shaheem, Shaheem the rugged child. Shaheen like, the rugged like, child, yep. Uh -huh. So it's like that's who I like it, like like in, in 2008 when we dropped the um the song called Staten Island, like and it was like Staten Island artists all older niggas and I was the young boy on it. So like I was kind of like I right, I'm chain gang, I've been nothing but that. And then he had his thing going, yeah. like he started rocking with me when we did Mama I Killed the Man 2009, and mm -hmm. then like he caught his case, which kind of like slowed me down because like 
I don't know the industry, like, and being from Staten Island, how you could test, like, we don't know the industry. Mm -hmm. like, that's right. when we kind of had mm -hmm. a thing with Wu-Tang, like, damn, bro, we, we don't- That was the only piece of industry we had, for real. Wu, and we don't, mm -hmm. we don't even know what's going, like, so it's like, when Sha got locked, I was like, all right, and then I, you know what I mean, I'm doing what I'm doing, I'm getting caught up in shit. So I find I dipped out to um um LA because my mom's and my pops and, and my sisters like yo you should try to write, and for some reason like some white boy I met and, and Cali shooting my video called me and was like yo can you write music like and I'm like hell yeah bro like things talking numbers like I ain't never wrote for nobody before but I'm like hell yeah like we gonna make it happen they're like yo I need you to build me a studio I'm like yeah I will build them I did that shit like I'm just <laughs> like, I'm trying to get out of New York you feel me like. I'm dead ducking, so like I was in between my court case and, and Jersey, and I told them like, yo, I don't even live out here. I live in, I live in um Cali, and my lawyer's like, yo, if you run with that and you could get an address and within the next sixty days, like we could probably get you probation out there, which is nothing because they like all like they don't care about nothing. You coming from out of state, so that's what I did. So I ended up, but what it did was tie me down, bro. Like to LA for the last four years. And it also took the last two years of my parents' life that I could have shared with them. Me thinking that I was I was running away from New York and how, like, like you know what I mean? Just running away and trying to bridge out. It, it, I didn't know that shit would happen, but like I said, it, it, it expanded my life and it just pulled me in a different, a different, different area. All right, so are you working on an album? And if so, what's the title and what's the first single? Um, we about to, we about to drop a mixtape, and then I'm gonna drop like an EP, like right after that for Apple Music, because like a okay. lot of the samples that we got on the mixtape and some of the features, I don't even feel like calling. Like I said, I'm independent, so mm -hmm. like I don't feel like even going that route. Like we don't gotta go, we don't gotta go crazy bro like everybody got their splits but i don't feel like going a whole budget in the marketing route so i'm gonna drop a mixtape with a lot of people that's in new york that i've been just collabing with and some of my artists that's on cgm it's called nizumania and it's definitely fire like and mm -hmm. then like i think i'm gonna drop like like nizumania part two like a day after on apple music with all different songs that is clear like and just Rock with them joints for the fourth quarter, and then like I don't, I'm telling y'all, January first, I'm going crazy. That's a fact. Yo, we need some, we need some music on Pip Radio. Definitely need some. Yeah, we definitely no, need. I, got, I need some so I can put on the show. Hell yeah! Definitely. You definitely. Let me know, like whatever, bro. I don't. You know what I mean, I could send whatever over there. I give niggas shit, exclusives, drops. I'm, I'm with everything, bro. Like, like this, this is what I do. Like, that's a fact, like that's a fact. I told y'all, bro, heavy supporter, man. I tap in with this one, man, man. So go ahead, shit. Ask your famous question. This my famous question. This my question. Okay. So I'm a, I'm gonna try to guess your sign. Then I'm gonna do something different this time, y'all. I'm gonna try to do something different this time. I'm gonna try to guess your sign and you let me know if I'm wrong or right or whatever. And then tell me your sign. So I'm gonna say you look like a water sign. A, a cancer, Pisces? Nah. Nope. Okay. <laughs> All right, cool. So what is your zodiac sign? Please don't say a Virgo. I'm definitely a Virgo. Big Virgo, you know? Like... <laughs> No, he's the Virgo. Hey, yeah. Hold on, hold on. I already knew that. What's what's wrong with Virgos, man? Hey, you got the blue <laughs> shirt on. That that shirt go hard. I need one of those. I knew. Yeah, uh, uh, I mean. <laughs> what you what's, September? What, what, uh, August, are you a September? August, 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 August. August. I'm August. August twenty eighth. Oh, okay. okay. All right. All right. September, that, that, Virgos, September Virgos is different, bro. They different. <laughs> yeah, it definitely is different. No, no motherfucking different. I don't. I don't. I. Die. Yeah, I had to realize that. I had to realize that because I, like, I was, I was just cool with a September Virgo, and I'm like, yeah, we the same, bro. Like, we was clicking, and then I'm like, yo, bro, you go a hoe, <laughs> like, like, we, like, you got some, that's you, must, fat. you must have got the bitch side of the Virgo. Bro. Damn, that's a fat. That's oh, a shit. fat. Okay, you kind of love my. I love, I love all my Virgos, bro, man. Like, 
I'm oh a my god. What's, what, what's your sign? Which I'm a Scorpio. Scorpio. Yeah. I'm a Sagittarius. I'm a Capricorn. I'm a Capricorn. All right. See, yeah. only one I know is January. Like January is Capricorn. So you now nah, I'm December. December 29th. December. Right, so yeah, yeah. December 29th. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Who's yeah. Birthday? That's somebody's birthday, right? Oh yeah, yeah. see, are right, you lit? You all right? <laughs> oh, Jerry, bro, you're like, oh, hell no, nah. get that nigga off the line, dog. Get that nigga off. Get that nigga off. I'm going, I'm going right now. In the interview, we going. <laughs> yeah, because the Virgo and Capricorn, yeah, y'all look kind of No, we, we cool. Y'all cool. cool. Capricorn. Virgo. Yo, I'm, I don't know. Maybe I'm a different Virgo. Everybody rock with me, man. Y'all cool. Do you like no, Virgo, Virgo's pieces? cool, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Virgo's cool. Ask the question. This is no, no, ask the question because that was my question. Because I'm the I'm the astrology guru. I was hoping you didn't say you was a Virgo. My ex husband's a Virgo. Um, but it's September, September, September. Yeah, he's um, different. See, I told you. Hold nah, up. they all say they different. You a smooth boy. You smooth <laughs> to hell, boy. You a Virgo boy. You got them, boy. You got your boy, your boy. <laughs> <laughs> boy, you go, boy. You can sell the car with no wheels. God damn, what? <laughs> oh, this is crazy. Hey, I don't down, believe, yo, yo, I don't even know. I can't even say I don't believe in this the astrology. I just don't know about it. Like, right. Hey, tap in with Shay Speaks. This man, yeah. I promise you, bro, the best yeah. reading. Nah, she might reality. scare me. She might have me out here really cussing out a white man or some shit. You go, you go cussing. You go, hey, like listen, hey, like, hey, listen, Nizzle, you go, you go cuss somebody out when you start giving her. You go cuss somebody out. <laughs> People like, man, fuck all these one. All right, man. So, so, this is my famous question on Piff Radio. This is my famous question. Do you like pineapples on pizza, Nizzle? Wait, he he don't he don't. Nah, I don't. I don't Boom! That's what the fuck I'm talking about. Boom! That's what I'm talking about. Pineapples on pizza. That's kind of weird, bro. What? So it, what? What is is New Yorkers don't like pine? Cause we this like you like the third New Yorkers. Real like, people. Don't like first, first of all, bro, I'm not even going cap. I don't even know. Like not not being funny. Like you ever been to New York? <laughs> nah, not yet. I, I've, I've been, been in New York, I've but not, but not. I I haven't been to the city yet. I've been upstate, like you know, right. Buffalo Jay, and all Jay, that place. You been to the city? city? Yeah. Shay, you been to the city? Shay? I've been I've been to New York once. I've been to, to Brooklyn. 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 I yeah, that's it. matter of fact. Yo, I swear to God, I feel like I seen you in Brooklyn, like like <laughs> a video or something. Like how you said, yeah. like, I got a sweet nigga. See yeah. how the Virgos is? Nah, they look, smooth, look, man. Look. They had you thinking, damn, it might have been me. No, good goddamn look, well, Atlanta, I ain't been on. Atlanta <laughs> don't got Atlanta. Atlanta don't got. That's one thing they not. They don't got. They don't got pizza. So it's nah, like, Atlanta, Atlanta's not yeah. big on you got pizza. No wings, though. Got I, you know so I understand y'all putting pineapples and shit on y'all pizza. <laughs> to try to make it. That is not the reason. <laughs> it's it's man. Yeah, that man. is yeah. not yeah. the reason. I understand that. So like I can't even fault y'all because y'all never had the real deal. Like y'all never had yo, bro. I'm a New Yorker and I'm the first probably New Yorker you're gonna hear say that Chicago piece is better than New York. Like I, I almost got into a fight over that. Really? Like, I don't know what Chicago pizza is, is crazy, bro. Chicago mm. pizza is crazy. Oh, Chicago. Oh, okay. Yeah, Chicago oh, yeah. You can't tell Chicago. nobody from me. Yeah, you can't tell. All say right, y'all. Yeah. We got to go ahead and wrap this up because I do got to go ahead and pick, you know what I'm saying? The girl up from work. She getting off at 10. I'm already. <laughs> <laughs> you already know I'm finna get cursed out, y'all. So look, 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 what's your social media handles? Where can the Yo, audience find you, man? Yeah, wow, you got any boy, websites, buddy. any merch, anything like that? You a wild boy, bro. <laughs> long walk, bro. Let's let's recap before we get there. No, no you can't make that time. Long walk, long, community long. pools, and he, he late to get his girl, bro. You, yo, that that's a dangerous man, bro. <laughs> dangerous man. But yo, y'all go follow me anywhere. Official Nizzle is my handle on most of all of the social medias, even like TikTok. I think I just got one. My um website's officialnizzle.com. And yeah, like if you Google Nizzle man, like everything will pop up. My Instagram's official Nizzle. I follow everybody back that look like they real. You know what I mean? <laughs> and and if, you, if you follow me, and then two days later you got that that shit on your page, talk about you made six thousand dollars. You out of here. Out of here. You out of here. You heard me? Hey, no question. I'm not DMing you. Say yo, is this you? Nothing. You out of here. You're not getting back. Hey, hey, hold on. 
Bro, as soon as I see, as soon as I see the, the little things in the profile, I'm it's, blocking. It's, Automatic. It's, oh, bro. Oh, hey, that hey, they DM, that nigga be like, hello. And you not getting How are you? <laughs> right, right. But yo. Oh, oh my gosh. Gives us a Pilf Radio drop. Drop. We need a drop. All right, but hold on. Let me get my cash out ready. No, I'm just <laughs> Yo, look. You ready? Y'all ready? Yes, yeah, yeah, sir. All right. Giggity gang gang. It's your boy Nizu, man. You know I'm only locked in with Piff Radio. They only get the exclusive. They rocking with Staten America, so I'm rocking with them. Gang. Hey. 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 No, no doubt. No doubt. doubt. Hey, Nizzle, I'm a producer, man, so I'm a, I am definitely got to see you some of my joints, yeah. too, man. Send me some shit, bro. Don't, you know what I mean? Send me, send, me, send me your top five records. Man, I'm going to see you my top shelf. Yeah, man. and also, like, um, <laughs> like, real quick, though, real quick, CG and publicity, that's, like, like that's Franny, that's my manager, and, like, that. I'm also, like, partnership in that, but I don't really do too much in that. But, like, that's her, her team, but they, they dope. They get a lot of placements for producers. Anybody that's doing anything in the industry, bro. Like, if you got a movie script, like CGM, like, we just linked the deal with Verizon. It's called Vumu. They got, like, they own demand. Shit, they pop the bus off it. So they need a bunch of movies, a bunch of content, a bunch of everything. So, like, Franny's Instagram is local FM. Definitely send over beats. Anything you got, bro, she be around all of the hottest artists as well. And it's definitely going to get placed somewhere nice, man. And I appreciate Piff Radio for giving me this platform. Say, I hope I change your mind about Virgos. Let me say, you know, gang. Yeah. Say, yo, Jay, you better watch for hobby, gang. He gonna get, he gonna get you, he gonna get you a look or two, bro. Don't let him around no, no community driven events, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yo, don't do me like that, gang. Come on, man. Yeah, gang. Let's go <laughs> that, bro. gang. Any school tours, you gotta sit the first ones out, man. <laughs> no, no, I'm just fucking with right, yeah. you. Right. I appreciate you, bro. Like, it's gonna go a long way. You keep doing what you're doing, bro. Keep reaching out to dope people. And I'm I'm definitely once this go up, let me know how I could promote it or whatever I gotta do. Like, I don't right. know if it's I don't know what it is. Like, I'm not even gonna front, like, but I'm just happy to be a part of it. Like I said, CGM got a lot of dope artists. We got um Take the Block. We just signed Take the Block. So we got Bobby Trends and his artists. So if y'all want to, you know what I mean, get 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 with a Franny, she, she send them Bobby Trends and his artists through y'all platform as well. And, and, you know, just build and just keep it going. No I mean? doubt. That's work. No, That's appreciate work. it. Appreciate you, Nizzle, man. Appreciate you, brother. Yeah, yeah, appreciate Thank you, man. Appreciate I appreciate it, right. you, bro. It was a pleasure. All right, bro. One. Two. All right, one. All right. Hey, that was late. I'm out. I'm fucking late. Like, All right. late. <laughs> Right, that yeah. was good. That All was right. good interview. That was good. That was good. That Do y'all want me to end the recording now, right? <laughs> I was trolling him. I was trolling him. That was the goal. Uh, did it work? Did it work? He's that was funny, man. Yeah, yeah. I, I, recording. End it. Yeah, I, I was trying. I was trying to do something different.